Chapter two. A house divided. Previously on The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, run! I'm out. Grab her. Let's go. Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was bit by a dog. For all we know, she could be working with Carver. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? I'm thinking about moving on. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Please. Ah! <laughs> I'm fine. I'm fine. Just... just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Come this way! Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! could have saved him! How could you just leave him? No, I couldn't have saved him. Trouble. What's the plan here, Nick? What are you doing, Nick? What the fuck? <laughs> Could have at least communicated that, Jesus. suicidal for a minute there. I'm sorry about Pete. Whatever. <laughs> Why'd you leave my uncle? Back at the stream. Yeah. Why'd you follow me? Pete got bit. What? He got bit. He wasn't going to make it. So I don't understand how majority of what people followed now? him. I don't care. If we're when stuck he was already here, dead. we should at least look around. Maybe we can find something to help us get out of here. Knock yourself out. <sighs> you ain't gonna help, are you? I'm surprised that little crate is enough to um stop the walkers from All opening the door. Rotten. Said this food is rotten. You don't care, Clem. But I do. What is that stuff? Let me see. Jam? <sighs> Whiskey. Oh, what the fuck? Now what? Oh, fuck if I know. We wait, I guess. So you get drunk and we wait? And I wait.
Motherfucker. What the fuck are you doing? He's drunk as hell, I ain't. Nick. Stop! I had to kill my mom. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on it. His big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I am. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. Everyone I grew up with, it all happened to them. Now, it's gonna happen to us. We're all so fucked. This whole world is fucked. We'll make it. Bullshit. You gotta believe you will. I mean, what's the point? We'll just march to some new place and somebody else will die. It's never gonna stop. Better than no Eventually, alternative. It'll be our turn. I can't believe we've been here a day. A day. It's been a day, right? Mm, well... Hey, kid. Have a drink with me. It's gonna be your first, and your last. <laughs> Won't be my loss, but I will to try. Peter Joseph Randall, the nicest mean old bastard I ever knew. Cheers, Nick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's all right, Clem. Listen, champ. They're not coming for us. You should go. Run for it. What are, what are you going to do? Stay here. I'm tired. Go find Luke and the rest. They'll take care of you. They're good people. I knew someone like you. He was always screwing up too. Screwing up? I didn't ask for any of this. Nobody does. But so what? Come with me. Are you kidding? And leave all this? You can't just sit here and die. Why not? What does it matter? You still have Luke and everyone else. Their family. Nick, I need your help. Please. Come on. You're right. Ooh. Yeah. Now look, if we get separated, the cabin's only half a mile from here. You can't miss it. No point of wallowing. You ready? Are you? Here's the question. Fuck it. Alright, time to run. Hey, over here! Come on, Nick. you fucks! Look at me! Get the fuck out of here! Thank you. I didn't see a point running to him, I don't know. He's done it for a reason, so, you know.
Clementine, are you all right? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? Huh? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! Clem. People killed. You did not deserve to call me that. I was with Nick, but... Both of you. My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Clementine, can you, can you please watch Sarah? She's upstairs. Just distract her. And don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. Now we'll be back soon. Now you trust and me? Thank you. I thought I should stay away from your daughter. Asshole. Say cheese! I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. What are you doing under the house? It's so cool. That looks scary. Take one of me. <laughs> Come on, take one of me. Sure. Get me in a good pose, okay? Oh god. Go on the pose then. Okay. I didn't even listen. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry, I interrupted. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Um Clem, you're scaring me. They're just fishing. I know that's not true. <sighs> you okay? What the fuck? Sorry, I, I, I just need to... What the fuck? What are you doing? Well, you want to see what I found? Uh, Will you show me how to use it? I couldn't find any bullets. Uh, if something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? True. As long as you don't tell your dad. I won't, I promise. First, remember, it's just a thing. What does that mean? Um, I don't know. <laughs> I thought it'd be heavier. Okay. What do I do? The most important thing is, when you go to shoot, take a breath before you pull the trigger. <sighs> Not that big. <sighs> what should I shoot? Don't do that! I... S -s -s sorry, sorry. Maybe I could practice outside. There's that tree. Maybe don't call walkers hey, to back. us. Jesus Christ. Thank God, I guess. Put the gun down, Sarah. Oh my God. Trigger happy. <laughs> but yes, it's good that she knows how to defend herself. Sorry, Carlos, but um, I'm just gonna take it to my own hands. My God, she's so sorry. I didn't see shit. That's not Luke. Clem, I think I know him. Who was that? He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Away from the windows. Where? Please. No. Clem, I can't breathe. Jesus Christ, what's wrong with you? She got like Hello? panic attacks? Motherfucker. Hello there. Don't open the door. Get out of here. Now. 
Is that how your dad taught you to greet a neighbor? Neighbor? I've got a gun. A smart Dang. girl. No, I would too. But I'm not a bad guy, honey. Promise you that. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. Pleasure to meet you. You mind if I come in for a bit? Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Just me and and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Your mom. Strong name. I like him already. <clears throat> Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking Ed. for my people. Nice. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Not my problem. Get out. What are you looking around for? Like, it's my place. Get here. What the fuck? Well, as far as he knows. Grab a gun, Clem. It's a lot fuck of plates off. for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, well, I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through or you been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. Now, I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Where does this go? Up yours. Oh, I'll take it. What the fuck do you think you're well, doing? It's a real nice place. Kind of cozy. I yep. knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. I don't care. You know, you're really not very polite for a little girl. And you're not very polite for an adult. Yeah. This is my house. Exactly, I was just about Fair to say point. that. Did you not hear me? Get the fuck out. Well, well. White's in trouble. You're in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I sneezed. Sarah, for fuck's sake. I thought you said nobody's here. Nobody is here. Do you mind? Where's the gun, Sarah? For fuck's sake. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Well, you Couldn't are. just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Like you? Sure. Who's this? Must be someone who lived here. Must be. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. 
Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Great, get the fuck out. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? We need to find the others. We can't go outside. <clears throat> Clementine. Sarah. You were with Nick, right? We gotta go find him. A man was here. Agreed. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? Yeah, but I think he was lying. What? I thought he said his name was George. George? Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. All right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy, or... Not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? Yes. He saw a picture of me. A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. If she hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Sorry, Sarah, Everyone but yeah, distract. Up. We're moving out. We need to know. We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. So that's Carver. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. Look, we gotta find Nick on our way out of here. You know where he was, right? Yeah. All, all right. He's all right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Now, you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. Not nah, shit. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. You and Alvin can probably relate. You need to stop bossing me around. This hasn't been easy on me, but I'm trying, Clem. Right, right. I know you so did your best back there. Hard. You're trying. You know, none of us would your make best. it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Yeah, yeah. Alvin and I still you don't really know what do. to call her. You or need to work on a lot, switched. actually, God, before you become me. a mother. Any ideas? Clem? Yeah, I'm just gonna walk away and ignore you. Because <laughs> I can't be fucked talking to you about your there. fucking baby That's and your baby we names. Because I don't give a shit. Nick! 
Nick. Get the door. Jesus. Hey, man. You got any aspirin? He's just drunk. You asshole. Dickhead. Pete's dead. I know, man, I do. We gotta get moving. Okay, Carver's gang showed up. Can you make it? Yeah. Yeah. Good, let's go. Sarah's gonna be upset now because hey, of Clem? Uh, I just want to say thanks for not giving up on me. I'm sorry about Pete. Yeah. Thanks. Wow, what's wrong with you, Luke? What happened back there in that cellar? He do something stupid? Like you can tell me. I'm just looking out for him. Nick saved my life. Really? Yeah. Sort of. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? You sure you still want to come with us? <laughs> yeah, well, Look, do I have a choice? I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher, but we all know you now. I don't have anywhere else to go. Well then, welcome to the party. Yeah. Thanks. We're, uh, we're smarter <laughs> than we look. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those yeah, mountains. Yeah, thanks. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Nick is just behind. Still wallowing. Jesus Christ. Five days later. Everyone's so tired. <laughs> They're all walking like walkers. Walkers. See anything? She better see something. We've been walking for a damn week. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. There's a building on the mountain. What's it look like? It's big. That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Better than north then. There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? It's pretty small. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Smart. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Well, I never said it was a good idea. But it's better than risking everyone at once. <laughs> What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. She's a valuable little girl. I mean, hell, if she can sew up her own arm, she's fit to cross a bridge. Yeah, I can do it. See? No problem. It's gonna be fine. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. 
Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? Oh, shit, If something all right. happens, I'll cover you. I actually like Luke. Come on. <laughs> Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just I could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. <laughs> You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? Uh, what does everyone want? Even the gangs. You know, what do you think they're all after? Family. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. Anyways, you, you can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. It's not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. Hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. <laughs> I'll take the big one. You get shorty. Wish we could use guns. We should be okay. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. Because I'm small. Makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cute. Ho. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. Oh shit. Oh damn. <laughs> Nice work, kid. Whoa, damn. Ow. Yeah. <laughs> He's like a brother. Yeah. Cute. Shit. Fuck off. Oh, oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. Lucky. I can't even see the writing, so I'm like, don't even pay attention to it. Yeah, we're not doing so well. What the fuck? How is this turning into this? It was like so standard. It's not that hard. It shouldn't be this hard. Come on, clam. Don't drop it. Wow, 
Well, that just happened. Thanks, Clem. Let's keep going. Fuck. How's your face, Luke? Jesus Christ. You see him? No, it's yeah. an illusion. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And shoot and me? Don't piss him off. And don't tell him anything. I'd shoot me. Well, that's a hell of a thing to say. I'm just saying. <laughs> well, if it comes to that, I'll shoot him first. <laughs> no, honestly, like, if it's well, a child or a man or a woman, Who's doesn't asking? matter now, does it? I mm. am. Wanna help me out here? I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Awkward. And you are? Huh. You don't look like assholes. Are you assholes? No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. True. I'm not an asshole. Well, are you calling me an asshole? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I mean, folks headed we're north both like not everyone assholes. else. Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the dazed and confused. <laughs> well. Have you seen someone named Krista? Krista? Maybe. Really? No, I mean, a lot of people come through here. I don't know. I am. Really? I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's, uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What? What's wrong? What the fuck, man? What the hell is he doing? Whoa, what the f no, what? No, 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 he's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Don't shoot! <laughs> that poor guy, what the fuck? Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? Damn it, Nick. Because we I spiked told you not him. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Who the fuck was that back there? I don't know. A friendly Looked face. Like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. He was about to shoot. Oh, was he? I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. What did you see, Clem? Was that guy going to shoot? Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't going to do anything. I know what I saw. He's so way, shit. You we'll stand him right there. What are you talking yeah, about? Yeah, but I didn't. Look. I, I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You can't go shooting people. You think he was with Carver? Fucking I don't Lord. know. I... No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We He's have to keep moving. Dead. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Look, you shot him in I the fucking neck. Alone? What do you think? Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Bex is dying here. Alvin, I told you I'm fine. Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. 
You could use a little downsizing. Why don't you go fucking to look? Sure. Thanks, Clem. What do I have to fucking do everything? Nick, I got you back, but damn, that was dumb. Yes. Thanks a lot for backing me up there. Well... I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Look, he's becoming a danger to the group. So who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. He seemed nice. Damn. If yeah, Alvin is in exactly. front of me, he takes that shot. What a fucking mess. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. He gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. Nah, <sighs> Nick. Can't say I'm out at you, Nick, but damn. Don't see a key around here. That man probably had it. Fuck. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Feels pretty good. Sure will. Y'all. Now you're coming then? Man, not thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. Dump? Guess he did have food. Man, fuck Nick. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. I mean, yeah, you I ever know. known anyone to do a thing like that? Lily. Lots of people. It happens all the time now. It's fucking crazy. Pardon my French. Yes, I'm aware. That's funny. She looks just like you. Yeah, hilarious. Hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but... And I'd never go against the group, but I've got to put Beck and the baby first. You understand, right? The whole group should decide. I know you're right. It's just so hard right now. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. You're welcome. The hell is that? The group should decide because you don't want him to start hiding things from the group. So as you do, then. Walkers. A we bunch got a of them. Here. What the fuck? Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. <laughs> Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Yeah, the point is for nothing well, be to, to know be able if anybody's to get actually in. back there. Could probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? 
Mm, nah, I don't. Be just don't like particularly. A what am I, a monkey? <laughs> a really tall treehouse. Well, what am I looking for? Anyone following us? How will we know it's them? We'll know. How would I know? Is the question actually? Look. You. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. Probably. You got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Parkour. Now, that was fun. Parkour. That sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. <gasps> oh, 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 you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. You just right, said just, don't just look down. down. Just for a second, okay? You just told me not to look. Good point. <laughs> oh, Luke, I, uh, yeah. Silly bugger. Hello, bird. Quack. I mean, made it. Cock. See anything? I can see the bridge. Oh shit. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. Fuck. They're on our trail. Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Wait, are you what? To rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Everyone calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Please, just do what he says. Penny. Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? Oh my god! Ha! So you didn't die! I see I knew it was either three of them. Kenny! I'll take that as Looking a Looking yes. good, Kenneth. These people with you? We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. You still an asshole, Are you Kenny? Sure you don't mind. It's gonna storm soon. Please come in. Clementine and Kenny. What the fuck? Cute. Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. Used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. <laughs> What's funny? <laughs> oh, nothing, Walt. Walter here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans, too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? Please, make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. Mm. The hell we will. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down, then. Kenny? Will you vouch for these people, Clem? Yes. If you tell me they're good, then I'm good. Us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. <laughs> Nick, be cool. Nick, a cute Dad, car. look! A Christmas tree! <laughs> Not now, Sarah. Oh my goodness. Isn't it great? 
We found it all in storage. It's amazing. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. Kenny, we gotta catch up, man. How'd you survive? Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? Yeah. You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to... It's just hard not to think about it, you know? He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. No. Hell. He was a hell of a guy. When my son, well, he took care of him. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid. Well, Krista and I were together for a while, but these guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. No, I'm gone. sorry, darling. I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's gonna be fine now. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shitbird, Ben. <laughs> it turned into a damn cluster. <laughs> Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, yeah, well. I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. It, uh... And then I met Sarita, thank God. Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two Looks catching like up? You went through Clem, hell, Kenny. this is my mm. girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice to meet you, Clementine. Oh. Hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, right? So they're together. Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Cute. Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? Sure. What is it? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. But Kenny, well, he never slows down. <laughs> yeah, that's We're Kenny. old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Where's Matthew? Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Everyone underestimates me. I expect you've used that to your advantage. True. Sometimes. True. Smart girl. You're not wrong. Yep. <laughs> mm. I've Almost learned done. from Would you do me the honor the of age tasting of the first course, madam? Course course. Looks great. It looks like mush. No, it doesn't. 
Mm-mm-mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. <laughs> huh. Striking resemblance. Oh my god, if I hear it one more time, I swear. Anyway, I'll take it from here. How did I help? I'm sorry, but how did I help with dinner? <laughs> oh, CD player. Let's Cousin play. Jared's concert, October 13th. 1998. Oh, maybe I don't want to listen to that. I thought maybe it's like Mariah Carey or something. <laughs> All I want for Christmas is food. What the fuck is that? <laughs> All I want for Christmas. Ew. What's this song you're humming? Good King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. Oh my fucking god, how do I get upstairs? What's so hard? The king that brings food to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the man. The storm is very strong. After a long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go on. Do I have but to? the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. Mark my footsteps, scoot my page, tread thou in them boldly. Thou Don't care about what your stupid, about what your stupid song. You can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We nah. can't be sure. Uh -huh. They might be tracking us. There were lights. Did what you, you fuckers forget? Ninjas? Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. Thank you. People? Way down there. How? She's got binoculars, genius. Yeah, yeah. Were you I boring think yesterday? Someone was following us. How do you know? How does she know? We have to assume I they're just back told there. You. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Isn't there a storm coming? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yeah, that's him. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. About what? Honey, I don't feel so good. Back, well, then wrong? lie down. I just need something to drink. You got it. I'll be right back. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Map of what? Come on. Frick. Where's the front door? Oh. Why is it not playing? I don't want to talk to them, please. Don't do this. Clem, we could use some help. Hey, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. I don't want to help. You knew Fuck Kenny sake. before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. But you must be so glad. It's weird to see him now. I'll bet, but he's so happy to see you. 
Yeah. Yeah. Yay. And I'm yeah. glad you're with us too. Perfect. Uh, yeah. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Fuck, seriously? Don't care. Put that on. What duck. a funny little guy. Quack. <gasps> we should do duck. Do duck. For duck. Quack. Quack, quack, quack. Quack. Quack, 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 Hayot. She looks so cool. Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Matthew and Walter are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. Where is Matthew? Oh, he likes to go on long walks. He and Walter used to vacation here. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He has good days and bad days like everyone else. He does seem different than I remember. In what way? I'm not sure. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, hon. I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? So he has a short temper. News to me. He's a bit different. I was gonna say he looks happier. But I guess not. Ah, <laughs> uh, does that mean... How long does it take to bring her a drink, Elvin? Because now I have to go and talk to Rebecca. This is so tedious. I'm, I'm not a fan of these new characters. Only I only like Luke and Nick as well. Are you okay? I like. Just got a little dizzy. Pete, and he died. I can't so. even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? Yeah. I mean, I don't how know. Can anyone now? Everything's so fucked up. I don't know. Yeah, that makes two of us. I know it's going to be hard. Sucks to suck. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. Yay. You want to listen? I don't know it's good, she. Huh? Gross. It's ah! okay. We're going to get you something soon. No thanks. That's okay. It's weird, right? Yeah, I don't know you like that. It's not his. How do you know? Well, how do you know? I just do. We were trying for so long and, and then... If Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's weird anymore. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Anyway, how did Thanks he know? Thanks for Clem. Well, everyone? Actually, I didn't Dinner know. is served. Come on, let's eat.
Oh my gosh, I'm yawning like hell. Mm-mm. Bite paints. You okay, man? Yeah, I'm just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Just try to forget about it. Right here, Clem. Oh, shit. Oh, look, he looks so sad. Oh, uh, Kenny. Oh, frick. I don't like that group. Well, most people, but I like Nick and Luke. Kenny, I don't know the other guys well enough. And Kenny. Kenny and Lee have had scraps, so. But he was always good to clam, I guess. I suppose. But, um, I don't know. I feel like. I knew. I knew Kenny. But I don't really know him now. So I'll go see it with my group and Luke. He looks so sad and disappointed. Can't disappoint my adopted brother from another mother. I'm sorry, Kenny. I'm sorry. Yeah, look at him. So what's the deal with your friend here? Yes, we were just talking about this Kenny. What do you make of him, Clem? I they seem like very him. accommodating for a bunch of people in a big house. I wouldn't say I trust him. Uh, I don't know. It's suspicious is all. Well, it's been a Just because I know him, I can't blindly just go on and be like, yeah, I trust Kenny. He was always kind of unhinged. I wouldn't... I wouldn't say as clam that she never liked him. I don't think that's fair. But definitely not sure on whether I trust him completely or not. I don't know how unhinged he is right now. Kenny is an interesting character to bring back. Because it's like, he's, like I said, he's very bipolar. It's like he's good and he's bad. And you never know with him. And like, if he, can you remember that? Is he going to use that against me? Which I think is kind of dumb. If he was to ever be mad about me sitting with them rather than with him. That's like a childish fucking move. Would be on his part, but that's just Kenny. Wild, but he seems a little different. Mm. Yeah, well, that happens. I mean, guy could have seen all kinds of shit. No sense jumping to conclusions. And he did. Walter was telling me his family died. That's horrible. Thing like that can hit a guy pretty hard. He lost his whole family? Wife and kid. Damn. He lost it a little after that. Lost it how? Well, he drinks. Oh. Well. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's... it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> so, it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold the out fuck? for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Yeah. Wellington? The hell is that? A place. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. Supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold-ass winter so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice, I don't know what you're... <laughs> what the fuck? Deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. Well, that'd be just fine by me. 
What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. Whoa, whoa, how did that escalate? Why is she getting mad? It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying? What? <laughs> Excuse me? Please, don't fight. Oh, huh? Kenny's like, she's staying. Excuse me? <laughs> Looks like now you're just coming with me. <laughs> Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Yeah, what the fuck? Now look, we've all had a long day. And excuse please me, Kenny. Wait. You can't just make decisions for me. I'll make decisions. Pass me that can, duck. <gasps> Quack. Duck? Who's Duck? Quack. 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 Duck was his son. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? Sure, yeah, I'd love to. Let's, let's, let's go. Oh man. Uh, oh, I'm man. sorry about that. You know, I used to be a teacher. Kenny, mm. man. I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. Oh, it may take so. a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Listen, relationships are like any Thanks. machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. What do you say? Will you help me work on them? We're gonna leave in the morning. No, no, you gotta stay. We have to keep moving. Clementine, in this world, you don't have to do anything. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People yeah, are I more political that. now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Didn't have the time. Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I Bro, I keep like hearing it. of this Matthew, but in any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice, right? It's never that easy. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm worried about your friend. I think that... Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. But I think... Hey, kids. What are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics. Yeah, that's right. That's right, Kenny. I one advantage yeah. of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. <laughs> I was just going to check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Miss? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Bonnie. Walt, I don't know. You just Bonnie. Gonna let her like that? <laughs> it's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt, how much damage can this poor woman do? It's too dangerous. We can't let her in. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be... Bonnie will remember that. So Bonnie's gonna stick around? Oh, fair enough. Yeah, probably long enough to remember that. Hmm. ...on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something up to you. Off you fuck them. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back.
I have a little girl like you. How so old it's are you? Fucking sweetie? when? I'm eleven. I would have thought older than that. Here you are, miss. This is too much. Don't mention it. I don't know how to thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Interesting. Funny how they brought the character back Clementine. from DLC. Don't freak out. Yeah, Walt. What the fuck? Walt just gave her all these fucking supplies, dude. He's way too nice. Way too nice. And naive. That's what he is. Naive. Well, if you do this and that, nothing will be wrong. Yeah, it's not as easy as that. Can't go wrong. Listen, yeah, you can. Okay, I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Serena. Fuck, I knew it. I knew it. <laughs> Fuck, that was Matthew. <sighs> oh, shit about their friend now they're all worried he's not back yet well she figured it out he was. i didn't for sure damn it damn it nick We're i don't think walter knows yet so we have to keep this quiet i mean who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out i won't say anything okay okay good now do you uh you still have that knife yeah, we can just leave Matthews in the morning. Walter sees it, he's gonna put Don't worry about it. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and, uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? <laughs> yeah, yeah, something like that. <laughs> hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. It's it's nothing, really. Forget it. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Come on, Nick, let's go find a beer or something. I don't want him panicking. I'm having, like, he's already feeling bad about him. And then he's gonna, his conscience gonna eat away at him. Already dealt with this bullshit it's before. Like Ben. And then, well, then he's gonna confess. This motherfucker went through my bag. Why are you touching my shit? Walter, put the knife down. I always like this knife. I like it too. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier or something about shooting a man. Fuck. See? I could see it. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then. But now? I can't lie. Then I'll look like a fucking prick when the truth comes out. If I don't lie...
Ugh. I can't lie. It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um... I don't feel good. Yeah. Yeah, Nick I don't shot suppose him. you would. Is, uh... Is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. He saved my life. Fuck. He was always going out alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell him what? What happened on the bridge? Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, 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 thought, I thought he was going to shoot my friends. And I... I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't, I didn't know if I hit him, but I did. And I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Um, can I have the knife? You know, for protection? Like, Walt, yeah. What's going on? Um. The storm's got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Nick, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? That thing's a damn dinner bell. Hell yeah, I'll take one. How to do this? Great. I can do it. Okay. How? Watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. How? Clem, how? I love how they're like, yeah, a child can do it. Yeah, no worries. What the fuck? Can't you adults figure it out? Use your fucking brain? There's a, yeah, there's always an emergency stop. How is a child able to do this? Oh my god, that's fucking pissing me off. I don't know how to do this. I can do it. Yeah, alright, no worries. Okay, right. Eight, 11 year old, you do it. Yeah, no worries, Clem. You sew so up your own fucking arm. Get back to the lodge. You turn the, off the fucking turbine because you're They're tech savvy. Us. You do this, you do that. I'm sick of doing shit for everyone. Fucking annoying. Stupid. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I'm confused. Yeah, I was not. That was confusing. Why was I.
Mother... Waste the weapon, motherfucker. See if I had a knife. Hey, there it is. Here's the wasted weapon. Move, bitch. Get out the way. Get out the way, bitch. Ooh. That's right, it has a kick, Clem. Did you forget? Hey, there's a knife. Knife is better. Yeah. Still grab the weapon. Please help me. Thanks, Walt. Fuck automatic weapons. Oh, for fuck, fuck, fuck. I knew it. I knew Bonnie was fucking Howdy not folks. to be trusted. Poking around. Motherfucker. Where's Rebecca? Carver. Nice to see you too. Oh! Dad! Sarah! Oh, you bitch. Inside. Clementine, I may know to be it's this you. such a keep moving. Bitchy kid. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Walter. You gave her all that food for nothing. Motherfucker. Look at this place. She. What do we do? What do we do? Leave this fucking place, Bonnie. Power and everything. A lot what of windows, though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. Man, how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them, too? Johnny, cover that window. Fuck, where's Luke and Kenny? Listen, I'm only gonna ask you once. Where's Rebecca? Sarah, look at me. It's gonna be okay. Oh. Oh. Rebecca! Oh. Rebecca! Our Fuck. baby deserves to be raised in a place of safety. 
I know you're out there. Oh. Melvin, Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. Ah, oh, shit. You this Unless I'm here. Quick, you all play nice. And show your Don't faces. Don't my dad, please. He'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Beck, the baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? How the hell am I supposed to know? They're still outside. They can help us. Let's get out of here. Only way out is through these windows. Clem can fit. You heard him. He knows she's here. <laughs> Clem can sneak out. Find Luke. Oh, what the hell is she going to do? God. And you heard him. Carver knows she's with us. Just stop. Don't hurt my dad, please. We're going down there. No. Kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Clem, go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. You don't know that. I'll find Luke and Kenny. Stay here. God damn it. You oh, never did fuck. listen. Hurry! Let's see if I can get your attention. Ah! Where the fuck did those two go? Yeah, faster planes, Jesus. Hey, clam. doing to him uh, fucked right. up that's fucked up where's Luke hell I don't know I was whining about something or other so I told him to take a hike so he did uh -uh. <gasps> no ah. oh. <laughs> Yo. Oh, fuck you, Bill. Pete. Looks like they got everyone. Who are these guys? Can we take them? I've got a pretty clear shot on the one. Just a little bit to the Yeah, we'll have to try. You son of a bitch. Yeah, get him. We have to try. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> See, I would like take a shot and then I would hide or go elsewhere. So it's like they know where the shot came from, but then I won't be there. And then next time when they try and like go to the place where I am, I'll take a shot from elsewhere. Or try to ambush them. I don't know. A man for a man. I see how it is. That's for our man. Now, I didn't want to do this, but you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. He's a piece I'm of shit. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Or you can give up now. Your choice. Mm -hmm. Motherfucker. Kenny, over there. Shoot 
sure it's not that easy. Alvin! Rebecca, don't look! Just don't look, Rebecca! Oh my god! Oh my god! I can keep this up all night! Sarita! We're coming out! Let's go. Where's Luke? Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. <laughs> Lovely. All right, round them up. We're heading back to camp. Sorry, Alvin, but I'm literally not that sad. I don't know. I don't care for some reason. I just feel so like. Yeah, I just, I just don't feel nothing. Like, I was just like, I knew what was gonna happen, and I'm like, yeah, just take a shot, shoot him. I knew he wasn't gonna kill him, but Son at least I got his shoulder. Shot Walt no matter what we did. Well, I ain't going out like that. Not without a fight. I, I know. The folks are sore over what happened. But let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters, and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them. Knowing full well, those who choose not to accept our love will surely wish that they had. A storm is on the way. I'm gonna kill Carver. Or at least I'll have something to do with it, I don't know. But I'll... If I have a choice, I'll definitely. Friendship. Took blame for Sarah's photo. You and 58.5% of players blamed someone else. Yeah, I saw that option and I was gonna do it. But... I didn't want to take the blame. I've been a punching bag for way too much. And to be fair, the only reason is, yeah, I kept her happy and distracted. So that's what Carlos wanted. So I, I guess most majority people agreed with me, but there's still like a little bit that decided against it, which I also get. Loyalty. Who did you sit with at dinner? You and 34.9% of players sat with Luke. I see that. I, a lot of people actually apparently are a fan of Kenny. I'm not. That's why I sat with the other group. So I understand why the majority sat with Kenny. Because they... And plus, it's like Kenny from the first game. Like, obviously you'd want to sit with not the new characters. You'd want to sit with the old character. But um, I think Luke is becoming like a close character to us, so I'd rather keep that friendship going. Honesty. Told Walter the truth about Matthew. You and 74% of players told Walter the truth. I couldn't lie. It would just bite me in the ass. It's Lying is never good. And <laughs> I, I never try and... Um, and I mean, I try sometimes, but it always fails, and I don't like lying. So, majority of people agree. Forgiveness, Nick's fate. You and 84.2% of players convinced Walter to forgive Nick. Yeah, I don't know why that little percentage decided to condemn Nick. Maybe because they butthurt over what he did. And I was at the start. 
But then you see that he's... He is sorry for it. He understands what he's done. It was dumb, callous, and stupid. Callous? Careless? Barf. Um, so I definitely need to forgive him, I guess. Or we'll try to. So yeah. It doesn't really matter, because Walter now is dead. Bravery. We'll have to find Kenny. Even 54% of players sought Kenny's help. Wow. Very 50-50 there. Yeah, I just thought it's better to fight back than to just give up and let them take over. Um, yeah, Walter was, uh, I guess... Oh, I don't know. Maybe Walter could have survived. I kind of have the feeling that Walter would have died regardless, like Kenny said. But Alvin, yeah, um, we didn't have to shoot and Alvin fucking died. <laughs> but, like I said, I don't know, I just haven't felt anything towards any of the characters so far. Like, if they were to die, I'd like, oh. I just wanna, I just want Clem to survive and just watch the world burn. I just wanna fuck shit up. Which is what I'm doing. So, we'll see what happens in this third episode, but I think it's gonna be full on. Uh, I'm actually excited to play it.